say hi mom can you say hi karen hi karen yeah see there you are you worried me today because you were not awake for even hardly five minutes today really yeah really and i was very worried so i'm happy you ate a good dinner or should i say drank a good dinner but you even ate some solid food today hooray but pureed of course but you had it, and, and who did you give the rest to? Do you remember? Did you give it to Chloe, the dog? Where's Chloe? Uh -huh. She's over there resting. But I wanted to tell you that you're the best mom in the whole wide world. Did you know that? Really? Really, it's true. Oh, that's wonderful. <laughs> you were always so loving and always there for me. And Robin, and Daddy, and everybody else. And you always had such a happy outlook on life. Really? Yeah. What do you mean? Yes, really. It's true. Oh. And I wanted to let you know, I know you haven't been feeling well. That So there's never anything left unsaid. How much I love you and how much you mean to me. Oh. And if you ever feel like it's time to leave this world... You don't have to worry about Robin and me. You have our permission and our blessing and that you would be able to join Daddy if you ever feel like it's time to go. Oh. We love you so much and we don't want you to feel like we're holding you back, okay? Okay. Is that fair enough? Yeah. Fair enough. So I wanted you to tell, because we were talking about David and Kyle and Angeline, can you say, I love you, David? Uh-huh. Say it. Love you, David. I love you, Kyle. Love you, Kyle. Love you, Angeline. I love you, Angeline. And I love you, Robin. And I love you, Robin. Yeah, so Robin's here all the time, your wonderful daughter, Robin. And I'm in Hawaii, but I'm happy I'm here now so I could be with you. Okay, I love you. You could say sweet dreams. Sweet dreams. Okay, sweet dreams, everybody. Okay.